Well, right here, I'm going to do a walkthrough. This is the double new design family trekker off road bunk van, and this one has arrived. And guess what? Yes, don't say it. Yes, it is available for immediate delivery. All right, so I'm just going to do a quick walkthrough on the outside, then I'm going to show you some um, inside some cool features on this van. So stay tuned. Um, we'll start at the front. Uh, DA35 all-terrain coupling. Uh, now, before I continue, folks, new design caravans, Australian-made caravan, uh, built in uh, Victoria, and I'm proud to have them here at Sunrise Caravans. Alrighty. So we've talked about the DA35 all-terrain coupling. Off-road van, you've got to have an all-terrain coupling. Uh, we've got an extended A-frame, we've got a stone guard here. As I always say, an off-road van is not complete without your Dometic dust reduction. So this Dometic dust reduction system will, uh, will help reduce the dust that comes in the van wherever you're tra uh, travelling around those off-road conditions as well, especially when it gets a bit dusty. Uh, but also on board on the roof, there is a two 180 watt solar panels and we've got the Horton air conditioner on board as well. All right, two nine kilo gas bottles as well. Uh, like I said, extended A-frame with large toolbox right here, folks. Uh, big slider here. Uh, ideal, like I said, to have your barbecue or your ingle fridge here as well. Uh, and we've got another slider on the other side of the van as well. Come right here. Yes, folks. Another slider there for your generator as well. And we've got the lift-up lid uh, to access uh, the big toolbox as well. We've got a spotlight right at the front of the van and we have a spotlight on the back. Uh, our chassis, like all our chassis in our yard, uh, made by Roadrunner Chassis. It's an Australian chassis manufacturer, family owned and operated in Melbourne, has been around since 2006 and they only use Australian steel. Uh, and our chassis thickness is three mil thick as well. Uh, I always say, guts of the caravan. If you've got the base right, the top will follow. Uh, underneath here, we've got a six inch drawbar and a six inch chassis. Now our six inch chassis goes right to the back. And if you go underneath here, our six inch drawbar goes to the front tire and then the six inch chassis goes all the way to the back of the van, give us uh, extra strength there as well. Three decent size um, awning lights. Look how long they are. Plenty of light out. So we've got one, two, three awning lights, or uh, well, three exterior lights on this side of the van, and we've got one on the off side of the van as well. Uh, your tunnel boot, that goes all the way through as well. Your drop down legs. External speakers, so you can really um, put your music on and have a great time out here with the family. Aussie Traveller awning. It's a tried and tested proven awning within our industry. Your grab handle there, uh, you've got a light there as well. So you've got more lighting on the outside. Nice slim windows, tinted as well. So keep your van nice and cool on the inside as well. Uh, 16 inch mud tires. So on this one here, off-road van, 16 inch mud tires as well. Underneath, we've got our recommended uh, suspension that we use, and that's the Austracker coil off-road suspension by Roadrunner Chassis. Uh, your external picnic table right here. Again, once you're out of here with the family, it's a great spot just to uh, keep all your things. Your TV connections right there. Taller cassette. Uh, we talked about the external speakers. We spin around this way. He's got some great safety features on his van. Electronic stability control, reversing camera as well. Um, external shower. We've got two jerry can holders on the back and your spare tire. There's your other spotlight and reversing camera as well, folks. We've got your hot water service right at the back there. And we've also got more room underneath the bunk area right there. On board, we've got two 95 litre fresh water tanks and a 95 litre grey water tank. Um, this one here has got lithium battery inside as well. So it's got, it's got some 
Besides the off-road capabilities, it's got a good uh, free camping uh, features off it, so you can stay off-grid for longer periods of time. Another light on the off-side of the van as well. Again, you don't see that too often. Right here, we've just got extra storage right here. Um, you can put your timbers and all that in there. Uh, your blocks, your, your timbers, your trucks and all that. So a good spot there. Uh, two separate water fillers for your 295 litre uh, water tanks. And like I said, your through boot that goes all the way through. Now what I'm gonna do folks, is I'm just gonna go underneath and we're gonna talk about the Oshtrekker coil off-road suspension. Folks, I'm under here and I'm pumped. Can't wait to show you the Oshtrekker coil off-road suspension. I just wanna tell you some key features about this suspension, why I use and recommend it and stand by this off-road suspension. 65 mil stub axles, that's right folks. 65 mil stub axles, three ton bearings. Uh, but the beauty about this one is, it's actually bolted to the chassis, not welded. So this is the Oshtrekker coil off-road suspension by Roadrunner chassis. Uh, this suspension will handle any rough terrain you take it on. No problem whatsoever. <sighs> okay. How was outside? Impressive, I thought it was, but inside is as impressive as well. So we're gonna start in the bedroom. Uh, so we come in, we've got the caravan queen here. Look at this, what a pillow top mattress here. Do you see that every day? One of the great features as well, plenty of room to walk around the bed. I can't stress that enough. Uh, that's one of the things sometimes caravans lack is, you know, the room around the bed um, to walk around. Uh, so we've got, Bedroom robes on either side of the cupboard. Oh, we've got the TV right there. Uh, the Isha Dometic dust reduction system right there. Uh, your two cupboards here over the bed uh, with the hidden latches. You know, if you watch my videos, you know how much I rave on about those. Oh, look, I love them. They're great. But cool feature about this fan is, so we've got a 2000 watt inverter and we've got a 200 amp lithium battery on board as well. So 2000 watt uh, inverter plus your 200 amp lithium battery on board as well. So again, you can free camp with this van uh, for longer. You've got the battery power, you've got the solar, you've got the water capacity. So you and the family can really you know, enjoy your favorite destinations for much longer. Great spot here for your TV. We spin around the TV right there, great for family time right there, everyone can watch. And most importantly for mummy and daddy, they can have a bit of me time watching some TV. Uh, your wine guard here, Sirocco fan, uh, got your skylight there, lights on the skylight as well. We can open up that for uh, more ventilation. Big large windows wherever you see around this van. Again, this van is done in a beautiful timber bench, uh, gray doors. Uh, but we've gone for something a little bit different. We've just gone for the chrome fittings in here. Got a nice big square sink, uh, big drainer there as well. Uh, three in one tap. We always got uh, clean water on board. We've got the water filter right there. Full stove and oven, three gas, one electric. We use Swift stove and ovens, all Australian made, which is another great feature of their products. Uh, great bench area here. Got a little pull out, roll out pantry right there. Great feature about uh, this battery management system. Right here, the tablet. We can access that on the phone. But um, this is cool. So, this is what I wanted to show you that it can just show you how much water is in the tanks. Um, we can obviously. Um, turn off each light zone as, as we choose, and our water pump goes through here as well. Um, and this is also compatible with the Smart Connect. We can connect our fridge sensors, our tyre sensors, and our gas sensors all to uh, this device as well. Um, and we've got this beautiful head unit right there as well. And again, just, they're just cupboards everywhere you look. 
Oh, I love them. And they're hidden latches as well. Piano hinges with gas struts. Well done. Beautiful. So, with the piano hinges and double gas struts, it will certainly give us extra structural durability. Now, as I said, this is a bunk van double, but if there's a third person that comes along, like an extra child or uh, an adult, we've already got another spot for them to sleep. So this is uh, theoretically a five berth caravan, two in there, two right here. And I'll, again, I'll just show you how quick that we can make a ready-made bed. Uh, so we've got the L-shaped lounge here, telescopic leg, and we've got your button in right here. We'll push the table down right down, slide it in, and then we've got your mattress. Right. And then in a matter of seconds, we can turn it from a bed back into a lounge area as well. And it's a decent size L-shaped lounge. Let me draw your attention to this big fridge. Look at that. This one here is a 224 litre three-way fridge. 224. That's massive, eh? Look at that. Wow. Okay, we move away from the fridge down to the bunk area. We've got uh, the double bunk, two bunks right here. Uh, we've got a fan on either bunk. Yes, that's correct. Fan on either bunk and double power point uh, with uh, reading lights on either bunk as well. This feel roomy. This feels pretty roomy to me. Love it. We can access the bunk under here with more storage. And always remember, we've also got the storage door on the outside that we can access from the outside in as well. Um, we come to the back here. Got plenty of uh, storage here for the kids' clothes. We like putting uh, shelves in because we feel you can pack more in there as well. Um, and you can just fold uh, all your kids' clothes. Under there, we've got your three and a half kilo Front loader washing machine as well. Kids will be kids, they'll get their clothes dirty, but thank God there's a three and a half kilo front loader on board to take care of that. From the bunk here, let's swing into the ensuite area. Look at it, I love the room in here. I love the room. Look, there's plenty of room I can, and, and this, because we used to, to, uh, the Tefet ceramic toilet. This actually uh, swivels as well, which is awesome. Gives us more room. Uh, but I just wanted to show you how much room we do have here um, in the ensuite while we're sitting on the toilet as well. Decent, again, decent size uh, hand basin. Pretty deep in my opinion. Uh, we can really get in there, wash our face, brush our teeth. Beautiful mirror there. More storage on board. Plus you've got um, a big window there and an exhaust fan right there that blows air in, blows air out and also got a light on there as well. But from there we go into the shower mould. Uh, I, I love our shower moulds, I think they're pretty big, they're, they're decent, there's plenty of room um, in here. Look at this, I'm having a shower, all right? but I can still freely move around here no problem whatsoever. I, I feel that's important. Yeah. Folks, I hope you enjoyed the walkthrough of the new design Family Trekker off-road double bank band that is available at Sunrise Caravans at 290 Eastern Service Road here at Burpagari. Uh, you can give us a call 073 888 or send us an email sales at sunrisecaravans.com.au. If you enjoyed the video, please Press the like button, uh, subscribe. We do have a lot of content coming. We've got more, uh, we've got more bunk vans arriving next week and they're available for immediate delivery, uh, but they'll be single axles and I can't wait to do the walkthroughs. We're open Monday to Friday, 8.30 to 5, or Saturday, 8.30 to 2.30. Look folks, thank you all for watching the video. Caravan Steve here. It's a pleasure having everyone. I love doing these videos and I can't wait to show you more. But in the meantime, folks, stay safe, follow your dreams with Sunrise Caravans and watch out for the next video.